guys welcome back so today I will be doing this look and it's a Christmas look it has the green eye green eyeliner and a red lip I feel like this would be perfect for a Christmas party or an ugly Christmas sweater party or if you're like me and you would wear it to I don't know church or just any regular day then that's for you too because that's who I am. Um, I didn't want to make it too, too weird so you can't wear it. So it is wearable, I think. But yeah, if you guys didn't know, this is my favorite time of the year. I love Christmas. I love winter. I love everything about Christmas. I love the decorations. I love the feeling, the music. And I really do feel like it puts out a really, really, really awesome vibe out there. I get really emotional this time of year because, I don't know, it's like love is in the air, literally. So I just love Christmas so much. And if it could be Christmas all year round, I would definitely love that. I do plan on recreating more Christmas looks for you guys since it's my favorite time of the year. So I hope I do get that out. Sometimes they say I'm gonna do something and then I don't. So yeah, if you guys wanna learn how I get this look, just keep on watching. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and prime my eyelids with my Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. And now I'm just gonna go ahead and set that with a light powder. And as you guys could already tell, I do have my eyebrows done and I did do my face makeup already. So, and then now I am gonna go ahead with my self made palette from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And I'm gonna grab the color Sherbet and with a blending brush, I'm going to just blend that into the crease as a transition color. Okay, so I really thought I was recording, but clearly I wasn't, so I'm sorry about that. But I just went ahead and added the color Isla from the self-made palette, and I just added all over my lid up to the crease. I'm just going to go ahead and blend that out with my blending brush now. So now that I blended the color Isla into the crease and that transition color, I do want Isla to be a little bit more pigmented. So I'm just going to go ahead and spray my Fix Plus into my brush and grab some of the color and just pack it onto my lid again. And then now I'm just going to try to blend out any harsh edges. And then with the same palette and the color Buttery, I'm just going to add that to my brow bone. And then with the clean brush, I'm just going to blend that color with the rest of the eyeshadows. And then now for the best part, I'm going to use the ColourPop Ultra Matte Lip in Dr. M. And I just think it's a beautiful color and yeah. I know it's a lipstick, but it looks really pretty as an eyeliner. Not saying always wear all your lipsticks as eyeliners, but it's a fun thing to do. I've kind of been trying it lately and I really like it. It's something new and something very creative. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead first and line it out and then I'm going to fill it up. So now I'm going to go ahead and add white eyeliner in my waterline. Oh, my eyes are going to water. So my eye was watering and I got some green on the inner corner. But I did put some white eyeliner just to cover it, supposedly. But I'll just have to work with that. Now with the ColourPop Super Shock Shadow, I'm going to go ahead and add that to my inner corner. So I know that I did that very intense, but I like that. So now I'm just gonna curl my eyelashes. And now I will be adding some Velour eyelashes. 
Now I'm just gonna go ahead and add some mascara to blend in my eyelashes to my falsies and also to my bottom eyelashes. Okay, so now I'm gonna move on to my lips and I'm gonna first moisturize my lips. And then now, of course, we're gonna go with Anastasia Beverly Hills Liquid Lipstick in Apple Candy. And I am obsessed with this color. Um, it's so pretty, it's a red and it has like glitters in it. And I just think it's so perfect for the holidays. And I know I've said it many times and I'm gonna keep saying it. I'm probably gonna be wearing this lip like most of the time this season just because, I mean, red lips right now, it's like the thing. And then this one's just so amazing. Usually, I don't feel like I have to moisturize when I do this lips. I mean, Anastasia lipsticks but my lips have been very dry so I am going to today but they're so creamy I love the formula of these And then just to clean up the edges, which I did do some mistakes, I'm just gonna go ahead and use my foundation. And it's the Born This Way in the color Light Beige. My concealer is really, really light right now because I do like to highlight my face. So yeah, I don't want like a white mark on my lips and then not blend in that good. So yeah guys, this is the final look and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to me yet, please don't forget to subscribe. And as always, if there's anything else you guys want to see, please don't be afraid to let me know and I will for sure get that out for you. Have a wonderful day guys and I will see you guys on the next one.